What's going on everybody and welcome back to Hippie Chilla. Unless you're new, then hi. And you're out of sync if you're new and watching this, go back to episode one. But we're gonna continue where we left off on Dimmy Doomy 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 Doom. Last time we found Wraiths. Apparently dead demons with the energy of hell coming out of their stomachs into a giant orb in the sky. I think they're the tether of hell energy or something like that. Not sure, but still cool. Uh, we're stabbing them in the chest. So yeah, so let's begin. See, 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 see right here. There's the crucible. And set. <laughs> it's like a key in the shape of a dagger that I want so badly. The race. Oh, I missed it. Ah. Down in another gullet. It's Olivia! I finally found- ooh, she's uglier. That she uglier. Me so I, was, I didn't think that was possible. That's not good. That's what you'll get. So long, farewell, goodbye, into... You're not dead, are you? Nope. She is now... A spider brain thing. Alrighty then. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Woo! Hey now. Hey! Hey! Lasers are my thing, okay? <laughs> what? Excuse me. I need to go get this. Thank you. No. Hey, no. Okay, getting close to her is a bad thing, apparently. Does these come back? Oh, so that's what that's good. Death to you! <laughs> Death to you! Deathy, deathy, okay. Uh, ow! Really? Really, Olivia? Really? Uh. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. Ooh, help. 
else over here? Oh yeah. I didn't jump in time. Well, yeah, that was round one. I got her down pretty far. Contact is dry. Why is it dry? Oh, now it's blurry. Can't see. Okay. And as you can see, my sinuses are clear right now. Not like earlier. <laughs> oh, they don't respawn. I just found both of them. Hey! 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 Come here. Uh, owie. Ah! Uh, no! Bad monkey! Sit. I did. Eat burritos. Yeah, that attachment isn't doing jack. Ow! E. <gasps> no. Nope. Really, dude? Really? Already with this? Or Snearius? Ugly, er. Mm, really? No, not you yet. Yes. What? Ammo would be nice.
death to you, she devil. Come here. Yay! What do I do to her? Oh, I shoved a damn few gun down her throat. Oh yeah, she definitely did. Gold guy. Oh, stiff neck. I don't even get anything else from her. Some armor, ammo, a new gun, something. Ah. That wasn't too bad of a boss you fight. The you last one was harder than that. You stopped the invasion and closed the portal. But it's come at a price. Argent. But at what cost? This entire operation. You see, watched you work. Come to understand your motivation. You think the only really? way is to kill them all, leave nothing behind. Oh well, yeah. And you may be right, but we can't just shut it all down. Without Argent Energy, it will be worse. I don't expect you to agree. But with this. We can continue. Hey, that's work. mine. I am not the villain in that's this. That's my story. sword thingy. I do what I do because there is no choice. We There's always a choice. Our time is up. I can't kill you, but I won't have you standing in our way. Until we see each other again. I didn't know it did that. I want that definitely. Wait, where are you tethering me? No, it can't end like that. No, 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 no. If I knew I was as close to the end, I would have just continued the last video. Sorry about that. <sighs> well, you're all right. This game. Nostalgia of the old games. A lot better though. A lot better graphics, of course. When I finally found one of the secret levels that harkened back to the old games, awesome. Looked just like it. A little weird that you are in the uh, DVD movie quality in a very pixelated world. <laughs> that was a little weird. But the hidden level looked just like the old games. Now I know there is multiplayer and stuff of this game, but I like single player. I like storyline. But the creators of this game did an awesome job at continuing. I hope they make another one because I want to take down that robot man. He stole my shiny thing. And I like my shiny things. 
the color schemes could have been better in the hell parts because most of the demons are red color based and with red mist and everything everywhere kind of hard to see I don't know if they did that on purpose so you wouldn't be able to see them that well and make it a little harder for you to kill them but not knowing that as a fact they they could have been tweaked to be a little different color or at least the environment not as red the storyline was awesome and hearing the legends of the actual doom guy towed by the demons was an awesome add-on. It really says how awesome we are. Armor created in hell and the demons fear us and everything. It started out good too. With you waking up on a slab and everything and just getting you right into the action. Not even letting you breathe. And the game is difficult. It brings out a ton of enemies at a time. And you have to make sure to always move, which I fail to do sometimes, yes. The boss fights were epic. Hard, but epic. As always, in most games, they're a lot bigger than you, or a multitude of them. Slowly introducing new enemies is a good thing. That's what the old games did, of course. And the music, the sounds, oh, audio files probably love this game. But in all, I not much they could have improved on, really. The color scheme on some parts, yes, but the environments were awesome looking. Color scheme on most of them were good, except for the red parts in hell, where you couldn't see an imp right in front of you, unless you looked really hard. The secrets were secret as secret could get. I know I missed a lot of secrets, a lot of upgrades, a lot of a lot, but as I said in my other videos, I'm in it for the storyline. Collecting, not high priority on my list. If you want to collect, as I've did the games that are on my channel so far, at least in the first episode I have a link in the description that you click and it'll take you right to where you can buy the game for yourself play it collect it see if you can find all of them me not finding them kind of gives you incentive to play the game yourself and see if you can find them a little challenge for all of my happy happy hippies that are watching <laughs> Which I hope you do, cause watching me play, yes, entertaining, a little rage inducing sometimes, at least for me it was, I don't know about you all, but playing a game for yourself is a lot different than watching somebody. Yes, I enjoy you watching me play, I know it helps people, especially when I'm talking to you. I know right now you can't hear me, but when it comes on, you have somebody talking, criticizing, commenting, having fun, and you get that sense that you're a part of it. It helps people. 
And I named my channel Hippie Chiller because the most chill people were hippies. Free love and and chillin' and everything and chill. The second part of my name. I want to help you all chill out after a hard days of work, girlfriend troubles, depression. I, I want to help. I can't tell you a prescription to take or something, no, I'm not a physician, but I can make you laugh, and laughter is one of the best medicines. You're having a hard day? Watch me rage because demons ate my spleen, which they did a lot, and ripped out my arms and head and legs and ate my stomach out. Burnt me with green lasers, fireballed me, the list goes on. Or me backing off of a cliff because I'm an idiot and don't look behind me when I'm backing up shooting demons, which I did at, at the least twice in this entire game. I don't know how often really, but I know I did. And I was like, oh! <laughs> but that... It, <laughs> What can I say? Little moments like that is what makes it awesome. Bethesda, I have to give it to you all. I, I know none of you are watching this, probably. But if you work at it and watch YouTubers play it to get criticism, which I think they should. Game developers should watch YouTubers, play their games, get the criticism, next game come out, Make it epic. Take everything that we say, everything in the comments, everything you see in the video, better it, epic size the next game, which I hope there is a next game, because like I said, I want to kill Hayden. He took my shiny crucible sword thingy. I didn't even know a big red glowing blade came out. If if so, I would have used it, because that would have been an awesome weapon. And I died a lot, yes. But as I said before, I don't remember when, but death is a part of gameplay. It shows you how hard it is. It makes you strive to do better than I did. Which I'm okay most of the time on games. Stupid stuff, yes, does does happen to me. I will jump right into a bullet or whatever. And a few times the game glitched and I went through the floor. That happened at least twice. That was irritating. By the way, I am talking a lot right now because I want to see if there's anything past the credits. Some games do that. Like a little sneak peek. Not many people wait and see. And this is a good time to talk to you and tell you my opinions about the game. I would rate it, but everyone has a different rating system. I ain't even gonna try. It's high up there. It's a question mark out of ten. Put your own number. But, yeah. This is an awesome game. I'm glad, finally, that I beat it. I'm gonna miss it. But that's part of playing a game. You get connected with it into the storyline and everything, and then it ends, and you have to find another game to play. Which, I have one or two more games that I am playing right now that I need to get back to, because I've been pounding this game out every day like a... I'm not even going to finish that analogy. <laughs> My mind was going somewhere. Yeah, stupid thing. 
Can we skip this? Okay, we can. I got impatient. But yeah. Ooh. Oh, that was fun. But if you liked it, punch, slap, and kick that subscription button. And like button. In all of its multi places. And come back for more. There will be plenty of more games. On as many systems as I can. Probably not Nintendo, because I hear that Nintendo likes to... Well, none of my videos right now have revenue, but they like to say, Oh, we own that, we own that, we own that, we own that, we own that. Except for the Switch. I don't, I don't get that. I, I have heard YouTubers talk about the Switch and everything. I'm going to have to look into that, because if so, one of these days, I'm going to have to buy a Switch and play some games on it. But other than that, yeah. Comment, subscribe, like, and I will see all of you in the next video. This has been Hippie Chilla saying stay chill.